I've always enjoyed drawing ever since I was, I think since the moment I could pick up a pencil or pen. And so art was, it was always the subject I enjoyed the most. And I think it was at Dean Close that I really built on that passion I had um, to the point where I decided that I wanted it to be a career. The moment that I first realised that I could actually do something with art was our first piece actually in uh, 3D where we were just very simple doing a still life which was of a tangerine and Miss Ash was like wow this is very expressive this is very different like I could see like you're almost your style in this piece and I was like oh okay maybe maybe I'm, maybe I'm actually all right then let me let me give it a try then. So it was in fourth form they really encouraged me to carry on with my art because I was considering it. I thought I could, should do more academic things. But then at the beginning of lower sixth for the sixth form, um, just how they encourage you to be so personal about your work and draw people you love and do ideas that really mean things to you. That's what really like kept me in my art and because it felt meaningful to me. It felt like I could do it forever. Uh, the attitude at Dean Coates was really to pursue your dream and just what you were passionate about and what you enjoyed, they said that you, sort of you can achieve that and uh, they really encourage you just to go, to go for it and commit to it. And for me, that, because I've been at Dean Close since year five, that really seemed quite normal, just to, if that was what I enjoyed doing, then that's what I should sort of chase. And, and I, I think after being at Dean Close and meeting different people from different backgrounds who had been sort of deterred by their school or their parents to take maybe a more academic route and a lot of them found that they weren't too happy with that and ended up uh, coming back into art and painting and in, in some ways they, they'd lost some years of painting which they, which they could have invested if they had had that encouragement and that support. And that was the, the brilliant thing about Dean Close, that they really supported you. Well, I came to this school for art. I have an art exhibition here. So I came here in year eight and met Miss Evans and Mrs. Rushton, and they looked at my art and they liked it. They were absolutely brilliant. I loved their energy, especially compared to my tiny prep school. It was brilliant. Such a wonderful art department, so well resourced, everything. We have kind of a saying for like the new people who come to Dean Close and they join art, that art is basically your second home in school because you get so engrossed in doing your artwork that you're literally here every single moment trying to develop it. You're here with Miss Ash who's also very passionate and all the other teachers like Miss Evans and Mrs. Rushton. They're so passionate that you just come into school, you're like, okay, I have this spare bit of time, like 30 minutes, let me go to the art block and see if I can do a bit more on my art piece or my art exam. Yeah. If you're a young person and you're coming to Dean Close and you're not really sure about art, I would say like what's what's the harm in trying because like for myself like I didn't know I was good at art my parents didn't know I was good at art I didn't even like give it two seconds of a thought but I said hey I'm in a new school it's Dean Close we Dean Close brings out some of probably the best artists I've seen for a while like in my age group like a lot of there's a lot of freedom of what you can do and a lot of help from the passionate teachers so if you're coming into Dean Close, definitely, definitely give it a try. Like you might be missing out on a long, lifelong passion and hobby. Yeah. Dean Close gives you confidence to to pursue things that you enjoy in life, and not to feel like you have to live uh, in a box. Really, they really sort of encourage you to, to pursue your passion as well. Uh, it was a really, yeah, it's a great place to be.